Over the past few days, uh, we've had a bit of toing and froing with Gisela, backwards and forwards to the vet, and uh, some things have improved, and inevitably some things haven't. And there are one or two things that are kind of holding her back a little bit. Um, but we've had the improvement now in the kennel cough. Um, today is the first day, this is on the 25th, that we haven't really had the convulsions and the incessant coughing that we had just a couple of days ago where she was coughing for probably an hour and a half non-stop around mid-morning. And um, there's also been a improvement in the poo um, because that's now got some form to it and uh, we can actually pick that up so that's a big improvement the downside is that the treatment from the Lishmania drug the uh, one that actually kills the parasite is causing her to be unwell um, she's not sh she's actually having a problem eating and uh, she's you know not uh, drinking properly and after three days on that one we've decided just to keep her on the maintenance Lishmania alpurinol uh, as opposed to the one that's going to be killing the parasite because the drug is so strong. So this is the one that's causing her to be unwell and um, she is now uh, fighting, she's got a temperature, she is um, eating again albeit uh, not very much and uh, she's keeping it down which is which is good so um, there's every reason to be hopeful that she may improve from here on but it's going to be as Maria is saying quite a long struggle to to make sure that uh, everything is in place for her to be well again and uh, it's going to be it's going to be tough for her but uh, she will get through this and probably a couple of months from now she will start to feel like she she did when she was probably well and fit but for now i think the best thing to do is to watch and listen to the conversations that have been taking place in the vet with Maria at Happy Pets. So, so you can actually get a flavour of what's involved with the treatment and how she's responding to it and the kind of things that um, she's saying about the fact that she's not really suffering and that she's actually uh, you know, responding well to the treatment really. Good girl. Clever girl. So head up, she's still, you know, she's still very thin, she's still not. I prefer, stop this one, carry on with this one, with the IV, with the B-tummy. The all this one, fine. And the rest of the treatment, the antibiotic, I'm going to do this today in the bay. So, she's going to have this one. Thank you. Thank you. Yesterday we were, we were accused of being cruel, keeping her alive. Oh, no. 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 She's no. not suffering, is no. she? No. no. She was no. suffering no. because she's yeah. not knowing. Have, you, have you seen her yeah. crying or, no. or, you know, when a dog is suffering, you you know because they they don't wait their tail they don't want to go for a walk they ride a tail yeah 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 Let's go to go to the for the main treatment for the strong one. Keep her hydrated. You know, she's looking for love. She's she's not. When a dog is is suffering, you know, you, they cry. They they doesn't know. And she's still, you know, fighting. I think she's still fighting. And see if she have a chance. Another dog would have been dead by now. But she wants to live. It's obvious she wants to mm. live. I was saying I'd boil up a chicken carcass. And if you drain it through and give her the liquid and she get yeah. there. And it, it got <laughs> chicken in the oven. If we see, you know, this takes the, the appetite away a lot. Uh -huh. This comes up with a lot of problem with the digestion. I read you that in, in Spanish yesterday. Yeah. 
So that's normal that sometimes when they withhold their treatment, plus this yeah, one that is very they, strong, they, they, they can have it. But you see, if you were cruel, you know, she's not responding, she had no diarrhea, she had no, no cough, she's responding to that. Yeah. So obviously we're going in the good, I was the first one in charge of you. If she's not, you know, if she's not sick enough, if she's just fed up, if she doesn't mm. want to fight, you know, maybe the best thing to do, yeah. I told you that, but she's fighting, I think she's, she's picking up from the, from the diarrhea, the cough is getting better. The, the act was in a borderline, the, the protein were fine, the kidney and liver are fine, so helismania at the moment is cutanea. This means that the main uh, problem we can see with the helismania on Feaparo is all the, the problem with the skin. Is the scar, in the ear, is the long nail. That's the helismania has three different uh, way to uh, one is ocular, it's in the eyes, one is in the eyes, one is in the eyes, and one is in the eyes, and that's the worst one. At the moment, we only have this in the skin, that we're going to carry on with the other, you know, we're not going to keep the lace mania to don't Getting worse. progress, mm. to don't arrive to the organ, to don't cause any problem. So this is the one that's making her ill, is it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So if we keep on, yeah. But you can see her teeth are left. She's look, watching around. She's beautiful. Yeah, that. She's tired, of course. She's tired and she's yeah. not. But she, she's fighting. Well, she went for a walk last night. Spending money on her. There is people who is doing a lot. You know, is giving donation. Let's go to give them. You know, and we. We have to be able to say we did or we could, yeah. you know. At the moment, see her that she's not fighting. No, this not get, we not yeah. arriving to any point, or she's not slowly going step by step to get better. I, I'm going to be the first one to say yeah. no. But at the moment, people are giving money for her. They, you know, child of all people from every part of the world. So let's give them. Mm. What they say, you know, what they're giving their money for. Yeah, because these people might not have given money if it hadn't been for her. And oh, they wouldn't have. No, that's for these people, for people to think that this dog is going to be like, you know, like other dogs that you give a week of treatment and they pick up and they recover, she's not going she's to not do that. You, you know, you have to know that. Why? Because she, she had been bad treated, not bad treated with no. Hito, but she had been not fed, not not. so mm. if she had the organ damage, I will say that's it, oh, but she, she had the organ fine, she, she's trying to, she's getting better from the cough and the, so why now, why not going being to cruel is to actually put her to sleep. I think put her to sleep, now she's fighting, yeah. that's cruel. Yeah. Because not be yeah. her the time, it's not, you know, she's fighting, let's go to be her the opportunity. Because what, what's happened to her in the past right. is cruel. What's exactly. happening now it's is not, not cruel. If we're giving her everything she needs, let's go to... Yes, she Oh, it's beautiful. She's yeah. been, uh, our watch. Come on, do you want to do it? 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 She said she, she wants to have a big house with a lot of colors. Yeah. She loved it. Every time she was working with me, she began to work in there. Uh, every time she took her, you know, she always loved her. Her. You remember me? Yeah. She's starting to remember all the people that are oh, yeah. caring for her now. Yeah. And she was back in her tail yesterday when people came and uh, saw her again. Um, and also, she well, was near at the work, and that's she, just because the door was opening. Um, she took time to work. come in and she talk and home. play, you know, everything. She didn't say 2080, she said she's going to go.